Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another TPX Reviews. Today's review is a long forgotten energy drink. Uh, I still have two flavors left, and I just never did them. But from a long, 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 long time ago, probably like a year, two, maybe even three, I don't remember. But I started the series, and I've been just doing them in very random, sporadic, uh, like leftover energy drink type deal. Um, yeah, Moonshot. It was a drink sent to me quite a long time ago. It was meant for official reviews, but I mean, I did the original, like my first review. I did them, I think, in by number. I'm not sure if I did them by number or whatever, but um, I mean, the drink never even received over 20 views, I think. So I was like, wow, this has got no interest at all. But I figured, hey, I still got these damn cans in the fridge. Um, I got this one and one other one I got a review. And it's just, oh well. Time to get these out of the fridge and review them. Um, yeah, so today's review is uh, Honey Peach. Uh, it is considered, let's see, jump into it. You've got a gold top and a black tab. Got gold all the way through the can. Looks pretty nice. It's got uh, caffeine, taurine, quercetin, B vitamins, 30% juice, cane sugar, natural flavors. 115 milligrams of caffeine total. It's got a pretty cool looking lion or yeah on it. Uh, yeah, honey peach premium energy. As it says and it's number four. They numbered each can um, to let you know that there is other flavors. I don't really know why they numbered them, but um, wasn't even like a like a. I don't even think you can buy this anymore. So this review is kind of silly, but. Yeah, whatever. So it's got 170 uh, calories, 42 grams of sugar, got some white grape juice and honey peach juice. This, uh, as you can see, this gives you an idea. Best Buy 828-2016. Um, yeah, <laughs> that's it's about, you can see how long ago they sent it to me. Probably 2015, if it were to go bad in 2016. I'm not sure, but um, it's old. It's old, dude. It's like four years. It's been a long time, but I don't care. I'm going to drink it now and whatever. So yeah, smells like peach. Kind of reminds me of the peach you get from Rockstar Peach Iced Tea, except none of the iced tea part of it. But pretty much that's the peach tea. I mean, it's the peach smell you get. It's got a very candy... Uh, very candy, like our, uh, peach rings. Definitely like a peach rings type of peach scent. So that's pretty cool. Cause it's a pretty good, uh, pretty good flavor. It smell to have. It's got a nice, pretty looking peachy color. That is kind of like. I don't know. I feel like I've seen peach juice before. Eh, that's about right. That, that's about it's about accurate to what it, uh, like a fuzzy navel juice or whatever they want to call it. Like if you've ever got, I got drinks out there that are like, you know, they talk about uh, the fuzzy navel or you know blah blah blah. Um, but then they. Like inside the, you know, you pour it out and either out of, out of dole drinks or whatever. They all generally um, end up looking something around this color. So, I'll give you a close up of it though. Look, it looks like it's got some stuff floating around in there. Who the hell knows what that is all about? Who knows? Could be expired. Whatever. Mm. Mm. It 
tastes funky. Mm. So it's got a pretty interesting peachy taste. Um, hmm. I also feel like it's kind of expired, but that's okay. Um, it still generally tastes, it definitely tastes off, um, but from what I can taste, it's a very nice um, kind of like, see what yeah it definitely has a very um, a nice peach flavor that um, it's hard to taste under what is expired but is there <laughs> Yep, I think I actually remember, so I actually had two cans, and somewhere along the line, I think I drank one of these already, um, and yeah, it was, it's basically a really delicious uh, honey flavor mixed with peach. It's very similar to, god, what's that peach drink that we, we just got? Um, I think I just did this review for you guys. Uh, I think it was close to the mango hyper, uh, the quick strike, or it was the peach, um, mm, damn, it was something recent, but it tastes just like it. It's a very, uh, like peach juice flavored like almost very natural it doesn't taste like artificial at all it's a very pleasant peach taste um it's it's very similar to a lot of drinks i've been drinking recently but i think they fall under the tropical what i've been reviewing is tropical or mango or whatever um but i've done so many peach reviews recently like kind of split scattered like it wasn't C4, it wasn't Hyde, but it was something, something like that. Um, but yeah, nonetheless, it was pretty good, pretty good. Um, but I can't give an accurate score since this one is kind of hard to <coughs> accurately review thanks to, you know, kind of what it tastes like now. Um, but if I had to go back in time, I think judging, um, it's a good thing I did have this already because I have th the taste for sure. Um, I definitely remember it. And I feel like, I feel like a, like an, like an 8.5 or nine is definitely comfortable. Um, cause I could taste exactly what the syrups all kind of tasted like. So, yeah, they all come together in a kind of nice, um, yeah, the syrups and the, and the juice and all that, it's, it's quite good. Um, it was quite, quite good. And, yeah, I feel like uh, 8.5 was what I would have given it because it was just so, um, it was a little unique, but kind of similar. You can find a lot of drinks now that are very similar. So, yeah, it's, you know. It's all good, but um, that's all I really have to say about this. Uh, yeah, 8.59. It's it's pretty good. Just uh, kind of sad I didn't review them earlier. I also didn't know they would expire. So, but whatever. So that's the story. <laughs> what are you gonna do? But uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. And um, overall, basically, I know it sounds simple that oh, it's just a peach energy drink. Yeah. It pretty much is. It's pretty pretty basic peach flavored energy drink. You can honestly, you could just get Rockstar's, uh, you know, peach iced tea. Call it a day. It's about the same, just without the 
the tea factor in it, but it's actually good that you're getting some tea out of it. So yeah, just go with that if you are curious about what moonshot tastes like. But uh, it's a little sweeter though. It's definitely like, I know that the iced tea has a little bit of a aftertaste, like the Exdurance, the peach iced tea, the one they, they have. Um, but uh, just, yeah, maybe without the tea, just this was without the tea. So imagine, and it's also like, yeah, it was a way better aftertaste. It's not so um, weird. So, yeah, whatever. But uh, that's about it. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next review. Peace.